All right, my friends, welcome back to Frogboy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew, and today we're going to do a little bit of rally racing on the Kama C12 with the uh, LC100 load cell pedals. I love these pedals, man. These things are freaking awesome. I think this is so incredible. I've got my R330 rim on my Kama C12. Absolutely incredible. I freaking love this. 330 millimeter rim. <laughs> <clears throat> I love it. This this to me is like I'm in rally freaking racing heaven, man. So let's go ahead and get started with this. We are on. Let's get her moving. catch myself I think I could catch the little yellow ghost car maybe I'm pretty sure that guy will mess up again he's not a very good driver but I'm not a very good driver either Oh, see, look, he crashed right there. <laughs> Twelve Newton meter rim, man. They freaking. Gives you a little bit of a, a little bit more power than you actually actually want. I like these pedals, man. These things are freaking we're very nice. Whew, man, I almost hit that rock. That would have been a good one. Uh, we are on WRC 10. Whoa, the yellow guy's catching up with me again. I better hurry up. That guy's a crazy driver though. You never know what he's gonna do. Steering rotation on this is set to 540. <clears throat> I used to go like 370 on this game, but um, I've gotten used to 540. Well, I'm getting used to 540, so. I want it to feel a little bit looser in the steering. <laughs> Never graceful on those freaking, on those acute hairpins, man. The 
the steering, the throttle control and everything on these pedals is so nice. Gosh. Braking feels incredible. Ooh. <clears throat> I like doing these long races. Hit that brake a little bit. I like that vibration that you get when you're sliding. It's, it's immersive. I mean, it does kind of sound a little bit noisy and stuff, but it feels pretty decent. Still hit the freaking stupid sign. I still hit it. <clears throat> Come on. Wow. <clears throat> Wowzer. Caution, 
I love the way these brakes feel, oh my gosh. So much freaking better. so much used to that 370 freaking um, rotation degrees of rotation in my steering rotation that I'm like it's a little bit it's a, it's just a little bit um, it's not uncomfortable it's just uh, I don't know it just feels a little bit weird so bear with me am I crashing my friends the overall the way the the, the car steers and, and like the brakes and everything now the throttle it just it, for some reason it just feels a little bit a little bit better Now I feel like I can I can just push the brakes and slow down. Whereas before I felt like I was more like mashing the brakes like all the time. Where now it feels more like a like a real experience in driving. That's that's crazy. Just how just how something like that can completely change the experience for you. Just having this this load cell brake. Um, <clears throat> and having it you know have like different pressure settings and stuff it uh it it really does kind of kind of um alter the experience we're going to go to another one of my tracks that that I really 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 like uh let's go over here i like doing this one on reverse so we're going to do this track too um i'm 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 just learning how to use these pedals on on this game so 
So kind of bear with me, my friends. As you can see, I woke up still in my pajamas. And we are getting right into it today. Well, actually, I didn't just wake up. I've been up for a couple hours, but... <laughs> oh, I wanted to get some racing in today because I got some, uh, some yard work stuff to do. But, man, that's what I... I like to do this on my weekend. Sometimes that's all I want to do is just race. And since getting these pedals, my friends, man, I just freaking want to drive. Gosh, it just feels so much smoother. I don't feel like I'm I don't feel like I have to do like that hard braking anymore and and I know that was messing me up because as I can tell like as I'm getting faster even on like a settle Corsa I'm, I'm a few seconds faster than I than I ever was before and the only thing changed out are the freaking brake pedals you know or, or the brakes and, and and how they're set up now that that completely like changed that experience for me See, I feel like I can take some of these turns a lot smoother. I don't feel like I'm losing control of my car for braking over over too hard and having to slide out on things and stuff. Um, that that's that's a big thing, you know. Just having that better footwork. So yeah, like these pedals obviously are awesome. They're they're definitely. I mean, they better be awesome. They're they're like two hundred and fifty bucks, man, compared to you know the the seventy dollar seventy nine dollar Fanatec pedals that I've been using for for a while now. I mean, gosh, and and it just feels a little bit more natural. See, like I'm slowing down. Still got a still got an e brake right there, but uh, I was I was gonna try to uh, to take that with. With just uh, <laughs> with just brake power, and I'm like, are you serious, dude? Are you really, are you really that weirded out, man? <laughs> on these, on the way these pedals feel, dude. Oh gosh, I'm, I I I forget that. Like, man, you're going faster than you're than you're really thinking or letting on. But man, just the easeability of, of how, how much smoother this feels. My gosh, man. Wowzer. Ooh. Dang, he was right on me. My my ghost was right on me. I feel like I have slightly better throttle control too, because there's a little bit more. I mean, there's there's definitely more pressure, or not pressure, but um, there's more tension on my throttle pedal, so it's so it's easier to hold like a like a set freaking throttle a little bit nicer now. Like this is this is way better. I, I I used to like literally guys, I would drive this game, and uh my uh my philosophy was just gun it all the time, whereas now I'm actually you know applying more of a controlled throttle throughout the throughout these turns and stuff. Wow. Looks like my old method on that turn was better. I felt like I had more control coming into that turn. Ooh. I wasn't breaking enough on that one. It's it's kind of got me a little bit weird now because now I'm 
now I'm a little bit off on my braking and stuff. But on my throttle control, that feels significantly more, uh, more, uh, more controlled. Ooh, still gonna hit that wall on that one. To just I'm trying to kind of stay behind him and follow him so I can see if the the new uh, method is Ooh, nope so yeah <clears throat> some of these spots I'm going to have to <clears throat> apply more brake pressure than what I'm doing but it's nowhere near as hard as I used to Interesting. So yeah, I'm gonna have to get used to these pedals all over again, man, because this is a. Uh, it's better for sure. Like this feels a lot smoother. I'm trying to get used to pedals and steering at the same time. That is not a... That's not a very, very wise thing to do. Ha! See, my steering used to be significantly more sharp at 320 or, or 370 or whatever I was using. Maybe I'll bump it down to like 480 and meet myself halfway. these because I think 480 would probably be a little bit better 5 540 or whatever I've got it set on is uh it feels just a little bit loose um I I kind of like the 540 on on gravel but when it comes to uh when it comes to the tarmac stages I think I'm gonna be 480 on those You know what? Like pumping the brakes like really hard kind of tilts my car too, though. So on certain turns, I'm just gonna have to learn how to do that. <clears throat> Man, it looks like I'm driving these tracks like a hundred freaking times again just to figure this out. But that's a good problem. <clears throat> that's a good problem. Um, a good problem definitely so all right my friends if you guys like this content do not forget to like and subscribe i'll see you guys in the next one thank you so much for watching and uh yes there's a link for all this camera stuff in the 
in the uh, in the description. So we'll see you guys later.